Time to meet our championship finalist for the men's 100 meter freestyle. Swimming out of lane number one. This is his first YMCA national event, making it back to an A final from Powell Crosley Jr. Owen Taylor. Lane number two, he was sixth in the 200 back from South Shore, Nick Topher. Lane number three, he was fifth in the 53, second in the 100 back this week from All Glaze Mercer, Ohio, Justin Flagel. Lane number four, our top seed coming in, he was 32nd in this event last year. First in the 100 back this week, second in the 50 free, second in the 200 free, and fourth in the 100 fly. Been busy from Somerset Hills, Jack Alexi. Lane number five. He was second in this event last year, sixth in the 50 fly, sixth in the 50 free this week. He'll be a Tiger at Princeton this fall. From Red Bank, Max Walther. Lane number six, 10th in this event last year, ninth in the two free, 17th in the 50 free this year from Jennersville, Michael Fazio. Lane number seven, first long course Y Nats. He see finaled in the 100 fly and be finaled in the 100 breast from Piedmont, Virginia, August Lamb. And in lane number eight, he was 15th in this event last year, 8th in the 2 free, 9th in the 4 free this week from Fanwood Scotch Plains, New Jersey, Logan D'Amore. Mr. Referee. Once again, national record, Joe Bonk from Triangle back in 2012, 50.17. Joe was out in 23.69. We'll keep our eye already out there in lane four. Jack Alexi having a big week, as I mentioned earlier. Jack's out 24.56. A little work to do to catch Henry Scutt, our defending champ, who missed the A final. Here comes Jack Alexi. Here comes Max Walter. Walter was second last year in this event. Here comes Alexi under the flags. They come too close to call for third, but it'll be Alexi at 51 41, followed by Walter at 52.07 and Mike Fazio at 